it's loading. It's actually going to happen. All right, so I guess this is where YouTube is going to pick up having missed all of my awkwardness for the past how long. Um, now we are going to actually play Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess, which was a gift from the community. So thank you guys. And I hope... Okay, so I have seen this game before, but it didn't stick. Except for part of the ending. But I, like, don't remember... I remember that there's, like, some sort of awesome, like, lady with a big nose to do with a rebellion. And, like, Princess Zelda is sad and there's stuff floating in the air. And... There's, like, two dimensions. And I don't mean, like, 2D, 3D. I mean, like, there's, like, another dimension or something. I don't know. <laughs> oh, and I remember thinking I was going to hate Midna, but then I didn't. So there you go. <laughs> there's, there's my memories. I remember that the ending is really sad. Or at least bittersweet. Oh, that's right! And you turn into a wolf! I have no idea why or how you turn into a wolf, but I remember that that happens. And that's totally Midna's mask and a wolf. And that theme, I think that's Midna's theme, and it's gorgeous. Okay, so, are you guys <laughs> ready for Lauren's failed memories? <laughs> Trying to remember this? This one is not lost in the depths of trauma the way my Metal Gear Solid memories were. Although I have to admit, I was surprisingly on point with that. <laughs> um, but... I, uh... I didn't play this one. I watched my ex-husband play it and I didn't watch all of it. So there may be a section where I'm like, oh, I remember this. But I don't know. So we just played Wind Waker, and I think it'll be interesting to go from one to the other, because Wind Waker... This music is really pretty. I'm just gonna just appreciate how pretty that is. Why is he riding around the side instead of just going straight down? Link, what are you doing? That's not... I mean, like, are you not supposed to cross that way? Like, I totally saw a guy walking across a... A uh, soccer fields when you're not uh, like wheeling his luggage across it and you're not supposed to do that you know you're supposed to walk around it and he didn't so maybe Link is trying to not be that guy oh man that's that's a satisfying sound okay um uh let's see what are we saying over here Aqua Magicist, I hope that you are doing all right. You're Ben, right? That's Ben. Well, I'm glad you're here, Ben, and hopefully you'll have fun with us. Hey, Rick Nicholas. Let's see. Snakebird Priestess, I hope you've had some good stuff happening um, in your life. Let's see. Okay, MDTA UK, I'm sorry, your metadata. <laughs> you're gonna be metadata to me. <laughs> I am that person. Good, Ben. I'm glad. Otherwise, I guess you could be a zombie because it is zombie month. <laughs> it's October. Um, no. Okay. Uh, so, so we just finished Wind Waker, which was interesting because Wind Waker had the most personality I'd ever seen for main Zelda cast. Um, Link has a personality. Zelda has a personality most of the time. Ganon is so cool. Um... And I loved that. I feel like a Grandpa Boat was really great too. Oh my God, that moment at the end. You know the one, don't say it in case people haven't played Wind Waker, but you know the moment I'm talking about. Um, but uh, uh, there, there wasn't, for all that the world was really distinctive, the NPC storylines weren't quite there and there were so many side quests that I really didn't want to do and I found it kind of open-ended um, and I'm gonna compare that story we're just gonna get a Zelda dump because I this is the third Zelda game I've played on stream oh there we go that's on there um, 
and and uh, so so the other one was Majora's Mask. And so the nice thing about Twilight Princess is that it's not alliterative, and you can't just turn the letters upside down to switch to the other. So hopefully I won't start calling this one by the other game's names because I called Majora's Mask Wind Waker when I was talking about it while playing Wind Waker, and I called Wind Waker Majora's Mask while playing Wind Waker. We'll see if I do better this time. Um, but no, so Majora's Mask was interesting because Link doesn't have much character in it. Zelda is not in it. Ganon is not in it, which I think was a great decision. Um, but what made Majora's Mask great? No, I never played Ocarina of Time on stream. I've just played through it twice with my ex-husband. Um, so that's why I never played any of the bosses myself because I was like, this is hard. I'll make someone else do it. Um, one of the nice things, I guess, about having to be a single woman doing it on my own is that I have to do the things that I might normally have said I couldn't do. But so Majora's Mask stands out because it has a, an exceptionally good um, NPC cast. So, um, and also it's really dark and I like dark things, but let's be real, Wind Waker is at its best when it's like juxtaposition of darkness and adorable innocence, um, which I think Wind Waker does really, really well. And it really understands that its hero is a child and the story does that and just, there's that moment again at the end of Wind Waker. Um, but so Majora's Mask is strong because of because the entire thing is side quests. The entire thing is like little sideways things to try to give NPCs what they want or solve their problems. And it's fantastic um, for that. So if you could have a Zelda game for, for me, because gameplay is not my priority, um, my ideal Zelda game would have personality for Link, Zelda, and Ganon, the way they are in Wind Waker, but also have a fully designed and fleshed out cast beyond just like, I mean, really Grandpa Boat is the only character with depth outside of the main three, I think. Maybe I'm forgetting someone. I liked some of the characters in it, don't get me wrong. Um, and you kind of, I mean, it, it doesn't, it's not a problem that Link in Majora's Mask is just a vessel for you to play because in a way he's a vessel through which the three spirits whose masks he can wear, um, he's the vessel for them to solve what is unresolved in their world. So it kind of, it kind of makes sense there that he doesn't have that much character to him. Um, but I'd like to see Link have a personality of his own um, and have friends and enemies that I know their names and care about them the way I did in Majora's Mask. Personally, I would like some darkness to the story, so I'm kind of optimistic because Twilight Princess, I mean, just like, like, look at this, look, there's like things on fire and there's a wolf and like a tree and Zelda's sad, like, and look, these look like friends, don't these look like friends? And maybe these are non-friends? I don't know. Um. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's friends and non-friends. Um, as far as gameplay goes, uh, it's really hard for me to judge because when I played Majora's Mask, I did not know how to solve Zelda puzzles. When I played Wind White Waker, I did. And so it was a much more satisfying experience in that regard. But I also found that the overworld wandering around aimlessly with a million mini games that I didn't care about or side quests that I didn't care about was the weakest part of Wind Waker. Um, so, we'll see what Twilight Princess is like. Chronologically, as far as when the game came out, Twilight Princess versus Wind Waker. Does anyone ever not name Link Link? I mean, if I could put, like, a heart and make him like Link Heart, I might do it. But, you know, Carlo, I don't know that I ever did. <laughs> I had a really really hard time with the controls in Majora's Mask. And part of that wasn't my fault. Part of that was the way things were set in my emulator. Um, but part of that was my fault. Um, Dark Souls and Talos Principle collectively made it so that I can beat games better and tackle challenges and puzzles in a way that I never thought I could. Z but Zora Link is my favorite story-wise though. He's the best, oh my God. He's like tragic and funny and electric guitar. Like, what not to love? Anyway. Anyway. Twilight Princess. 
I have no idea. There's a lot of great things in Majora's Mask, in my opinion. I thought it was an excellent game. But let's dive in and see what the future holds. I mean, probably Twilight Princess is kind of the sequel to Majora's Mask. I guess, like, feeling-wise. Yeah, I remember people getting really up and arms. I'm sorry, I know you guys maybe are wanting me to dive right into the game, but I feel like we kind of need to talk about it a little bit. Um, I remember when uh, Wind Waker came out and people flipped up because they didn't like their graphics. We had seen um, a design for Link that actually was kind of more like the Twilight Princess Link. And for me, I think I've mentioned <laughs> before on stream that when I was a kid, I had these extremely vivid dreams about hanging out with Link like he was my big brother and he looked a lot like he does in Twilight Princess. So I was totally on board with the Twilight Princess design, um, but I don't think I got all grumpy about Toon Link, so. Time travel paradox. Okay, we're gonna do normal mode, not hero mode because I have nothing to prove. <laughs> Let's do this. It's pretty. I don't know how much difference the HD version makes. Okay, I'm pretty sure that that's Link on the right, which means I have a friend. Maybe I have a dad. That looks kind of like a sword that I could get. Well, that would satisfy my need for characterization. I bet there's a Japanese name for the feel, or even, a, or maybe a German word for that, that feeling of sadness and nostalgia that strikes at dusk. So. Ah, this is appropriate to be playing around October. Isn't that what um, the uh, Day of the Dead is supposed to be? The, the time that the veil between the land of the living and the land of the dead is thinnest? So, already this is going to be Ghost Zelda. Oh my god. He looks happy. Okay, that is me. <gasps> He's so cute! Oh my gosh, and he has a very sweet face. Okay, so we are in Hyrule. We have the royal family. A moth dude, um, your name is a good. Oh, we're not in Hyrule! Oh man. Okay, I know those places. I've been there. Haven't been there very much. Link looks so sweet. Is Are these outfits based on any particular, like, Japanese village outfits or anything? The way that they've got these ties around their waist make me think yes. He's so cute. Oh my gosh. Is that Epina? Do I have Epina already? Is Epina a Clydesdale? There is nothing cuter than a fuzzy-footed horse. So pretty. Well, but having the like almost obi-like sashes at the waist is extremely Japanese looking to me. Oh, she's so cute. Look at how cute my horse is. Oh my gosh. I'm cute. My horse is cute. I live in a tree house. I have a family? Is that my sibling? Oh, he's so cute. Oh my gosh. I live in a tree house. 
That's got to be an intentional throwback to Ocarina of Time. Okay, was that... Yeah, doesn't this look like... This... Isn't this how Ocarina of, Ocarina of Time starts? Okay. I'm glad that's not- oh my god. Oh no. <laughs> You've seen Piggy Herder. Now get ready for Goat Herder. <laughs> oh god. This is dangerous. So I don't know exactly how you're supposed to pronounce Epina, but I know that there's supposed to be lyrics to, um, there's some sort of really cute little lyrics that were written, I, possibly by Miyamoto himself, to Epina's song, and it's Epona, Epona, so it, I don't know, that's, that's how I've always said it. Where the three syllables are kind of equally weighted. Okay. Controls. Oh, I look super serious. Look at me. Look at how serious. Hmm. Serious rank. There's a squirrel. No, that, is that a squirrel or a chipmunk? Is that, is that a chipmunk? We don't have chipmunks in Texas. So it looks like a squirrel with chipmunk coloring. I mean, I guess this is fantasy land. Will you be my friend? Probably not if I step on you. I'm practicing my goat herding on the squirrel. Squirrel herding simulator 2000. Oh my God. Pick up, oh yes. Okay, well I'm not gonna throw this at my friend. Any of my friends. Okay, do you do the same thing? You don't. Do you don't do the same thing. You do. Okay. It's the same controls, isn't it? Oh man. So I'm just glancing over at chat because it's not immediately get out of the way. Chip. Well, chip roll squirrel monk. I don't know. Man, I'm not very good at this. Am I? Yes, I have just uncovered the most important button in the game. Oh man, the animation is nice. Okay, so this is my house. What's back here? Oh, oh. Where you're keeping all of this delicious limestone. Does anybody know what that's a reference to? <laughs> all right, friend. I'm gonna break all the rocks. It's like a. Oh, 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 there's a rupee under that one. Why didn't the first one break? Dosmea, I'm starting at 7 Eastern time, but we started half an hour late today because I had to update my N NVIDIA graphics driver because OBS said so and it took a while. Uh, so we're pretty close. So you haven't missed a lot. Anyway, Proto is about to regale us with a pun. You can't leave us hanging. What is your pun? 
Man, now I want to see if I can get another rock. Oh, man. Oh, hey, Canadians. I bought my first package of uh, all-dressed uh, potato chips. Is that what they're called? Because I've never had them before. And they're ubiquitous. And I feel like that is a thing that I should experience since I'm living in Canada. And they were a dollar. So it seemed like a good idea. Uh, man, friend, you are <gasps> adorable. Look at him. He looks like a character I would write about. Oh, he looks sad and confused. I guess his goats have run away. He's pretty buff goat herder. Okay, I think I set up and I go this way. Okay, cameras. Okay, I've had ketchup chips before and I thought they were weird. It's a Zelda game. The, and it, the, the friends, everybody's always highly stylized. <gasps> Can I roll through this? I'm going to roll into it. <laughs> to know that ramming my face into the wall continues to be. <laughs> Hi, Ella. You hear Ella meowing in the back? Oh, oh, oh. He has way more dignity doing this than Wind Waker Link did. Wind Waker Link looked so serious. Let's see where that took me. Oh shoot, this is where I'm supposed to be, isn't it? That won't do. That won't do. Can't be done. So sorry. Not today. Any other day. But not today. Uh... Oh, I like that you can see. Look, if you look above the cracks, you can see the forest. Oh, look at him, like... Crawling forward on his little pawsies, except instead of pawsies, they're fingers. Okay. Well, we're going to continue going not where we're supposed to go. Oh, shoot. Wait. Is that where I came from? No, this is not where I came from. Okay. This is pretty. This is the nicest bridge off limits sign I've ever seen. Although, I wonder if... Because for my first thought is that the the plants are like here to make it look pretty. But I actually think the plants are here to make it look overgrown. Like nobody has opened this gate in a really long time. Maybe? There's not any ivy going over like the joint here. So maybe not. Hmm. Oh, is that quote about laser dragons talking about Bahamut? Because Bahamut is the most interesting and awesome summon in that game. I tell you guys I started writing uh, an academic style essay on uh, parent-child relationships and their legacy in Final Fantasy X. Didn't finish it. I'll finish it eventually. I've been distracted. Hmm... But yeah, everyone in Zelda games is super stylized. They're really kind of horrifying looking in Ocarina of Time. Okay. <gasps> Why are these plants horseshoes? That's not what plants do. Is she going to sing to Epina? Oh my gosh, she has duck tails on her hair. This has to be my girlfriend. These are the two ladies in Link's life. So either she's gonna die horribly or Link and Zelda don't actually have romantic tension in this game. Look at his happy smile. Oh, what a cutie. This looks like a more important place than just like, give your horsey a bath here. This makes me think of the pond where d the pond near dusk in uh, Dark Souls. This is about twilight, twilight, dusk, almost the same. C 
clearly I have concluded that Ula Seal and Hyrule are the same place. Look at that rainbow. Listen to the camera going under the water again. Let's do that. That's so cool. All right, let us talk to our girlfriend here. and She's gonna tell us how to ride the horse. What is your name, friend? Oh. My gosh. Is he gonna play it on grass? That's really cute. All right, this must be how we summon. <gasps> okay, that's not what, I, it's not what making noise on a blade of grass looks like, which I, by the way, can't do. I've tried really hard. But that's kind of the sound that it makes. <gasps> Hi, Athena. Aww. <laughs> She's super adorable. I like her little, like, cozy pajamas dress. <gasps> Horsey time. Horsey time. Horsey time. Horsey time. Yes, Afana is really magnificently adorable and big. Okay, so clearly there being flowers on the gate does not mean the gates don't open. Well, that answers that. I'm not good at riding vehicles in games, just to warn you guys, since I don't think you've seen me do that. So, be warned that this could be really awkward. Oh, no, you've seen me ride some Epona really badly in... Majora's Mask. Oh, he leans back. I I didn't like that. I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> I'm really good at controls. This is where I came from. Look, Grandpa Boat is easier to steer than most vehicles. I love how reminiscent this music is of Kakariko Village without having the same melody. So there's my dad and my sibling and my pregnant mom. <gasps> I have to go talk to everybody. You know how it is. Hi. Oh my gosh. She actually looks like a person. <laughs> As you know, Bob. Okay, you may be able to talk to people from the horse, but I can't drive the horse and talk to people at the same time. You don't want to see it. I'll just start trampling over small children. It's really quite ugly. <sighs> oh no. Oh no, the head packed husband. No. That little girl totally has a crush on Link, but she's a baby child. Oh my god, you can't even talk to the dad. Oh, he's cute though! Look at his happy face. And his cheekbones. Look at their pretty house. Oh no, it's locked. <gasps> this, my friends, do you see? They have a kitty sign and a kitty door. They have a kitty door. Oh, it's probably because, here, let me see what I can do about that. Um, does Maya. Does that cut out the echo somewhat? Cause I can, I can try right now. I'm trying to make it so that it, it's a directional microphone so it, it shouldn't pick up what's going on behind there there I've 
turn the music down a bit too. Let me know if that's a bit better. Oh, that didn't that didn't help at all. <gasps> yes, I'm swimming. Oh, he does he does sideways swimming. Can you guys still hear me pretty clearly? It looks like the numbers of my voice, the 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 lines that show me how loud I am look like I'm still audible. Okay, excellent. Okay, so you... Oh, what? You can still hear me here. Okay. Can you hear the music? Am I too quiet? Okay, because I just turned the gain super down because I've got this right in my face. So it shouldn't be picking up anything except what's immediately by it, which is me. Okay. So that works. That's hilarious. I've never turned my gain all the way down. Am I too much quieter from what I was? Let me, let's test something, friends. Tell me if you can hear the echo there. Oh, really, Desmea? Interesting. Okay. Well, that's handy. Okay, so you aren't getting an echo? Yes, now we know. And also, I accidentally targeted that by putting the uh, thing on my lap. Okay, no echo. Well, the people who were disgruntled about the echo during the uh, the uh, Wind Waker stream can be happy to know. Are you, Desmaya, are you listening on headphones? And is anyone else listening on headphones? Yeah, and I've had people point out um, on YouTube that there's an echo, too. Was that only you, Desmaya? Okay. <gasps> Happy Halloween! I have a pumpkin. Are you excited? I am excited. I'm gonna throw it against the tree though. That was satisfying. <gasps> oh my god, I can have a picnic! Talo and Malo. Oh my goodness, isn't there a Malo in um, Mario RPG? Paper Mario? One of the Marios that I didn't think. I don't know. Well, we're potentially going to do more capture carding. So not having the echo would be great. They're keeping me from being... Look, you can't make me go the way I'm supposed to go. I reject your efforts. What? That didn't work. Does my hair change color because it's wet? I'm rolling in the water, but it's probably not my best idea ever. Hey, Skaplooney, thank you for hosting. Yeah, I think my hair is lighter when it dries out. I was gonna say something and I got distracted. Okay, so it looks like my family is staring adoringly at dad as he practices sword fighting. No, I want to read the sign. Epina, you're not a sign. I'm sorry, friend. No, don't look at your horse. It's a very nice horse. Water wall. Woods and spirit spring. That's not going to be important or anything like that. Well, Geo Dude, if you believe that you're role playing as um in, in, a, in a game like this, then that just means this is what Link always does. No, chicken. Yes. I love that Zelda chickens almost always make a variation on the same sound. 
Okay, hold on, we gotta do this. Yes! Yes! So good. So good. I love it so much. Oh, of course, you can't not not hit a chicken. Like, you don't have a choice in the matter. Yes! The best vehicle in any game. Chicken time! I don't really think there's much of anywhere I can go. So I think I'm just tormenting this poor creature for no reason. It's really not happy! But it's amazing, isn't it, that a chicken is able to keep somebody like Link afloat? Okay, well look, if the pigs were this distressed... <laughs> I just interrupted Dad's sword practice with my birdie. Oh my god. Like, what would a piggy do if it started writhing around? Also, you're like half, like a tiny, tiny fraction of the size of the piggy. The big piggy in Wind Waker, so. Ba -da, ba -da. Hello, sibling. Oh! <gasps> what a precious child! I will be ready for fishing. No, mini games. Hello, mom. Okay, so technically not my mom, but whatever. Functionally speaking, this is dad, mom, and sibling. Oh man, hi dad. How are you, dad? <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay, so brother. That's adorable. Okay, Zelda game. Twilight Princess, if you slaughter my adorable family, I'm gonna be really mad at you. I don't think they'd do that. If this were like any other game series, like if this was a JRPG, these people would be dead. Like by sunrise. But it's a Zelda game and they're probably not going to participate in like or, or have like wholesale slaughter of entire innocent villages right off the bat. So probably we're good. What's over here? Can I do anything here? Oh, I'm going to be able to do something here, maybe. <laughs> Slam my face into the rock. Fishies! Fishies, I'm gonna eat you. I actually don't like fish, but Link likes fish. Alright, I guess I'd better actually get on my horse and go where I'm supposed to go. Having done everything but ride my horse. No, that's the wrong button. Huh. Oh, there's another, this is a dude. Hi dude, are you my friend? No, you look like a blacksmith. Are you the village blacksmith? Do you have horns? Tusks. No, I think that's a mustache. I don't think he has. Are those my goats? Oh my god, do they have unicorns? Those things in front of the doors that show you whose door it is are, must be shedded goat horns. I think. Hey oh, they won't listen to a word I say. Oh my gosh. I mean, I could say no. Oh my god. I love the way you can like hear his accent. You are a nice young man. I hope you get a lovely person who appreciates you. Hey -ya. Hey -ya. 
go in. Oh my god. There's not a time limit. So I can drive them into go on. Go on, yes, goat on. This is not what I'm supposed to do. Come on, Lauren. I need to remember that I don't have to press A to go. It's not actually a vehicle. It's like an extension of your body. Hey, so this is a moment, an opportunity for me to give a little uh, PSA. By the way, if you don't know, speaking of uh, things that are methods of transportation that are like a part of your, your body, don't go touching someone's like a uh, wheelchair or motorized chair without their permission because it's basically an extension of their body. So you may not know that. So no, goats, get back. Oh my God, they're so mean. Anyway, yeah, so that's your that's your little PSA if you didn't know, and you might know already. God, go, 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 these are con some contrary jerk goats. Why is that one red? What happened? Oh my god! He just rammed me. Did you see that? Did you see that? What a jerk. Okay, goats. Go. 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 Yes, you, yes, that's right, you little butt. I'm pretty sure that chasing goats on a horse is not my true calling, but I'm gonna do my best because my adorable friend with the big nose asked me. And as a fellow person with a big nose, I really... No, go, yeah, that's right, that's right. That's right, buddy. Go on, you little butt. You little butt, what are you doing? No, go, go, go. Go, go. I'm really good at driving my horse. Go. Okay, we just got two more. I'm gonna see if I can make it mad. Yeah! Oh my god, the little like cowbell sound that rings. Those other guys just like chilling here. No! Nobody! Uh uh. Uh uh. No! Go on! Uh huh. Go! What do you think you're doing, buddy? Slacking off on the job, my friend. No! No! Go on! Go on! No! In! go in. That delights me. Oh, that's right, because I'm going to be going out of town. Huh, <sighs> sure. Oh, he's so adorable. Oh my gosh. Just jump the gate. <laughs> that wasn't right. This is good, I need to learn what I'm doing here. Okay. Maybe if you go faster, then you can do this. All right. Nope. Sorry, Epina. Yeah. 
Yeah, I don't like it being spurs, but I guess maybe that's supposed to feel more realistic. Yes! I jumped it, I jumped it, I jumped it! Yes! Hello, friend. If I run right at him, will he jump out of the way? Get on the horse. Okay. Well, we'll never know because I can't actually aim at people very well. Oh my god, okay, you don't have to hit the A button to go as the horse. I've learned this eventually. Don't have to hit the A button to go. Just go. Just just drive. I forgot. <laughs> Again, that you don't have to hit the A button. Ah. Okay, well. I did that. Oh, look at all those stars that you can see because there's no light pollution because there aren't any big cities here. Magical. Yes, I want to save. I'm glad that the game reminded me. Oh, this. Okay. Oh my god. There are children waiting for me. Probably like just morning time. <gasps> it's my tree house. Oh my god, I have a tree house. I want this tree house. Oh my god, I want this. Jump down. Okay, this link practice this this link believes in safety. He does not just jump off of his <gasps> Oh my god, there are cameras. No, there's not cameras. I'm I'm an artist. Those are my paintings. Look, I have sketch I have pencils and uh paper and it looks like I can take a nap on here or draw yes do I have like a no no oh my gosh I'm adorable okay so that's the mini map there was I swear there was a like zoom in to look at things there, no, uh, huh. Anyway, I like, and then he's like painted some cloth with a goat design. What an adorable link. See again, he won't just like jump off of railings here. He's so much more to put together and mature than Wind Waker Link or Lauren. I'm trying to look at everything. Look at that crest. Have you seen that crest before? Is that crest in any other Zelda's? Sorry, the camera really wants to do a disco party time. <gasps> oh my gosh, he painted a goat and he drew his friend, but really dramatically. So it's like a black and white picture, except that his friend's eyes are green. Oh, Link. Is that Link's boyfriend? Does Link have a boyfriend and a girlfriend? That'd be adorable. Let's see. Link does an okay job cleaning up after himself with the dishes. He's got bread and apples and uh, like soup that might be on fire. You're, maybe that's gruel. Sorry, it's really important that I look through all of my stuff. I want this house. I want this house. Why is there a giant fork on the wall? And a whip? What do you use a giant fork for? And are those pieces of bread hanging from there? I guess that's, no, that's corn. He's drying corn so he can make popcorn. Oh my God, that's adorable. Yes, he is like an assistant pig keeper. Here's my saddle and my saddle stuff. Uh, what's, okay, there's more fabric. Is that my laundry hamper? No, is that my booze? Link! Link! How grown up are you? Is that your booze? Link! 
I mean, I guess he's probably old enough. All right, well, wait, hold on, what's that? Oh, that's the dishes in the sink. I mean, not everywhere in the real world has air conditioning and some places don't need it. Oh dear. No, is this, is this my way out or is this my way into my evil basement? Why do you have an evil basement, Link? Don't, oh my God, is this my evil basement? Holy crap, Link, maybe let's not. Let's not, just, just, nope. Nope. Probably not. Good. Maybe we can go down there and get eaten by a Gru. See how there's like a map here? It shows me like, like the, oh my God, look at, look at the arrow on the map. Look at the arrow on the map. It's wiggling. I'm scared. Oh, I got stuck on something. I'm like watching my little like arrow self darting. Wow, I look like I'm running really fast. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, eep, eep, no, no. Okay, I got it. I didn't die, I faced my fears. I went into the creepy basement and there were no screaming undead, making it better than the vast majority of creepy basements in Zelda games. So. Whoop. I kinda wanna like, zoom this in this camera thingy so you can't see how messy my room is. But apparently I don't get to do that. No, not that. Mm. Now you can see, you can see an Ella kitty next to my head. Okay. Look, there are screaming zombies in other real basements. There, now you can see Ella. How's that? Is that better? Do you guys approve the fact that you can see Ella? There we go. Thanksgiving was good. I uh, had a little bit of a little bit of stress and anxiety because I was hanging around with family members that I don't know very well. And by don't know very well, I mean have seen twice my entire life up until this. But okay, there. So you can see my kitty, 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 kitty. In fact, I bet I could make it so you can see my kitty, kitty even better. Hold on. There we go. Now you can see the kitty. All right, that's better. I feel slightly less self-conscious about the messiness of my room, even though you can actually see there's like, oh, I guess it's not that bad. It's just like my laptop and these pillows are so that I can sit in bed and work while petting Ella. That's Ella. Um, anyway, <laughs> here are some children. The one with the, she have a different hair ribbon thingy than she did yesterday? She's definitely the ringleader here. Oh, and there's my little brother over there. Look at their eyebrows. I'm gonna get in so much trouble slingshotting everything. This is amazing. Well, does me you can't see all of the other mess in my room, but believe me, it's there. I need, I, I need it. I must try it. Okay, so Talo and Mallow are those two little ones, including the like, oh my God, the baby has a grumpy bulldog face. Doesn't, doesn't she? <laughs> Beth. Oh. 
Can you trade your water wheel? Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just trade families, okay? No big deal. Oh my gosh. Precious. No, I thought it was funnier when I was stalking the children. He's like, oh shoot, oh shoot. <laughs> okay, so apparently my link is just really weird. <sighs> that, that kid, the, the ringleader there totally has, um, is this a rupee? Yes. Totally has Tetra's little look and mannerism. Hello, sibling of mine, and your sad, sleepy eyes. Ha <laughs> ha That's really cute. This child respected me sleeping. <laughs> okay, my, do I have gladiator sandals? Oh, I guess I kind of do. They, they roll with it, Geodude, they roll with it. <laughs> anyway, I'm a very serious and grown up. So why did these children yell at me to wake up? I don't know. Baby children, man. <laughs> Okay, I can't ride my horsey. Well, why is she saddled then? Why do I have little one shoulder armor thing? Where am I going? Where am I? Oh, am I going to go to the... Oh man, maybe my girlfriend's there. Let's go see if my girlfriend's there. Oh, what? She doesn't just like randomly hang around the mysterious spirit pool all the time? Which can't possibly be significant. Climb! Climb the thing! I want to go and investigate that, like... Oh my god. Link, I know that, like, all of this bloom is really impressive, but could you maybe climb up the waterfall so I can go... <laughs> Link. Alright, well that's not gonna happen. I'm totally going to sneak in through there at some point later. It'll be very important. <laughs> Alas, I like that they have like the little detail of like the chain kind of swinging and rattling as you slam your face into it. Bum, bum, bum. There sure are a lot of rocks. Oh, I guess I'm going to get a slingshot. I wonder if those giant rocks shrink to become small enough to slingshot. Oh my gosh, amazing. Very exciting. So I technically live on the outskirts of the village. Let me come over here and get... No, I thought I saw a rupee. I did not see a rupee. Mm, there are rupees in the grass, though. Yes. I can totally buy a slingshot with all of those rupees that I just got. I've got, like... Five rupees. Okay, clearly this music is catchy. Wait, this is where I just. Am I getting lost in the village? I think I am. Wait, but I. But wait. Where else can I go? Oh, this way? This isn't the way I came. This is a different way. Never mind. Ignore me. Ignore me. I did it! Hello, friendly person. <gasps> Aww. So 
I'm glad I discovered the water in the game. Because I'm going to climb up there and have bees after me. And then I'm going to run into the water because that's what you do. No, that didn't work. That's not where the bees are. Okay. Hold on. Are you guys ready to get really sad? Wait, how do I use the I want to use the... Oh, there's... Yes. Maybe if I do this, he'll give me the slingshot for risking bees. That wasn't right. <laughs> Market shouldn't do most people speedrun it. Oh. He told me how to go into first person. This is like the most conveniently shaped ivy ever. Also, look at my cute little froggy pose. Man, imagine jumping from here with the chicken. Amazing. Oh, shoot! Yep. Oh, shoot. I knew it. 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 I, at least I know in the world... I need to get a slingshot. Give me a slingshot, buddy, and I will slingshot those bees. <laughs> what could it be? What could it be? Uh, yeah, no, his hair totally gets gets darker when it gets wet. It's a lovely detail. I have to go find the cat. Oh my gosh. Cat! Cat, cat, cat! I don't get to go inside this house. Alas, no house for me. I don't, I, as you can probably tell, if you haven't seen my streams before, Markishin, I don't speed run. <laughs> I'm not very fast. Oh good, I can invade people's homes now. This is excellent. Oh, this is the pumpkin place. Oh yes, look, they've got pumpkins. And they've got pumpkins on here. That's how you know the pumpkin farmers. And look at those creepy. Those totally look like something you would buy at like Hobby Lobby. Uh. Oh, no, 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 it's fine, Markage. I'm, I'm mostly making fun of myself because, oh my god. That's really uncomfortable, guys. Okay, how do I zoom in? I, I click the stick. Oh. <gasps> Puppies! Okay, this is like... Right here, this is a study in differences. The cute puppy and the horrifying little doll. But, you know, I'm just joking about myself because um, I have been told that I am a sponge runner or a sloth runner. <laughs> okay, look at all these. God, I, I could smash that pottery, but then she'd be sad. Pet the puppy! Pet the puppy! Pet the puppy! Yes! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is the best Zelda ever. Oh my god. Look, look, look. I have a puppy! I have a puppy! <laughs> and just the way he holds the puppy. He's like cradling the puppy. This Link is really good with animals, which I guess is kind of his thing. You kind of get the feeling that his quietness is in character, you know, instead of just being a silent hero. Like, this Link doesn't talk much, but he's sweet and gentle and good with animals, and he's precious. Oh my god. Oh, look at him! Oh, he's totally got a Triforce on his hand. Well, that answers that. Listen to the puppy making happy noises. What a cute puppy. Okay, can I talk to her while I'm holding her puppy? Aww. Okay, so he's the blacksmith. Hmm. It totally has the horns. It has like elements that are vaguely reminiscent of the usual Hyrule crest. Mm 
No, it's cool. I just wanted to hang out with your puppy. Look, like the little details, like the fact that they're drying their fish over there. Oh my god, my puppy. Oh my god. Place. You don't throw the puppy. You place the puppy. You see, like, there's no option for, th for throw. Because Link would never do that. Link would never throw a puppy. Oh my god, look at all these creepy... Whose creepy dolls are these? Oh, he doesn't just go vaulting off of ledges. Oh my god. This is so different. He, like, slows down and jumps down in a controlled and grown-up manner. None of this, like, jumping off of ledges willy-nilly while shrieking at the top of his lungs. <laughs> like Wind Waker Link. We just played through Wind Waker and beat it a couple of weeks ago, so it's fresh in my mind. How do I get up there? I want to get up to that secret place, but I don't get to, huh? Man. This place is creepy, but it has a puppy, so. Yeah, because that's not, this is not Beth's home. That's the shopkeeper's kid. Oh, there's a rupee. Link, Link, why can't, oh my god, Link, you're way too polite. Oh, he totally does say something though. He totally does say, huh. his voice is a little deeper than I think. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. Can I help you with stuff? Oh, I do want to play Link's Awakening. I'm going to get a Switch at some point. I'm actually going to be applying for a full-time job because I've been working as a freelancer and I'm happy being a freelancer, but it's a super cool job. Directly the kind of thing that I do at the super awesome museum in town um, opened up and a friend pointed it out who works there and she says it's awesome. So I'm going to probably send in my application to them tomorrow. Um, and if that goes well, then I'll get a Switch when I've got money. Otherwise, it might take a little bit because um, moving is expensive and I'm still recovering from that. Um, but I actually own a Switch game now. <laughs> I got the collector's edition of Transistor um, and I got it for the Switch because I knew I was going to get a Switch eventually. So I'll play Link's Awakening at some point, which I never beat the first time around. Um, yes, Proto, I figured that you would appreciate a shout out to Transistor. Oh my gosh. She's adorable. Oh my god, did you... Did you lose your cradle? She looks so sad. How did you lose your cradle? I just want to know why... Okay. Well, that's all right. They look like tusks, don't they? <laughs> what? Why don't you have any faith in him? Ah! Oh no! Well, thank you for following. Good luck with your translation. What languages do you translate? Between. Plant your feet while grabbing it with A. Oh, here's another chicken. You were right. That other chicken being a brown chicken does seem to be an anomaly. Sorry, chicken. I had to grab you in the name of science. You know how it is. We gotta go find a cradle. Oh, there's the brown chicken. Okay, where would the cradle have gotten off to? <laughs> oh, this one's a rooster! Hi, rooster! This rooster is like, uh-uh, uh-uh. <gasps> Friend! Friend! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, kitty, oh my god, kitty, oh my god, it's a cat, 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 guys, I like cats. Meow! 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 Ooh, English and German, oh, that's cool. 
My mother grew up speaking German at home, but I never learned. Um, oh no, child. You get back here. Kitty, 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 God, it's such a cutie kitty. The animation is really good. No! Oh my god, just like look at the like proud little strut of this kitty. Oh my god, meow! 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 Just waiting to see if Ella gets. All right, is this the shop? Oh wait, I was supposed to go get the cradle. Oh no, this isn't the shop. Oh my God, look at the puppy. Did you see the puppy's entire butt waggling? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That is so cute. I am delighted. All right, let's jump back in the water and see. Is this the way that we're going? Oh, he tries to dive, but instead he just kind of jumped in with his shoulder. Oh, the monkey! You little butt! How do I get to you? Um, how do I get there? I gotta go teach that monkey a lesson. Oh my gosh, I just realized they also have a cat head on their weather vane. That's precious. All right. Maybe mom will give me some advice if I tell her it's the, the monkey. All right. I guess I'll probably go fish and give some fish to the, to the kitty. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay, so since I moved to Toronto, I have to say um, I really enjoyed, apparently there's a really healthy bartering scene here. So I've had a lot of fun trading things. My favorite was when I traded a, a very basic hair dryer, like blow dryer, for a sack of sugar. <laughs> In the rain, we met outside of a, outside of a shopper's drug mart. And I got a sack of sugar. And I told the guy, I was like, I don't know if it's any good on hair because I've only ever used it for art projects. And he was like, oh, I'm going to be using it for industrial projects. And I was like, well, it was pretty great. But yeah, so I've been having a lot of fun trading stuff. Um, I've traded, I traded some banana bread and zucchini, uh, chocolate zucchini bread for um, somebody had made this uh, kind of salsa type stuff that was a... Uh, peppers and fruits so there's like jalapeno pineapple jalapeno blueberry and mango habanero so I think it's the coolest thing and I was all excited about trading some of my baked goods for stuff but then there's somebody who's actually a really good baker who is trying to who's seeing what people will trade for like their super super gorgeous professional looking pies I was like no my simple zucchini loaf doesn't hold a candle to that. But people seem to like the taste of the stuff that I make, so it's okay if it's not pretty. Right? How am I gonna get to the monkey? Hmm. Oh, you're the mayor. Hey! Oh my god. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I hope I I tried. <sighs> All right. Give me the slingshot, buddy. Okay, maybe the slingshot shot is in your house. If I get the slingshot, I can attack. Oh! Oh, she's so sad without her kitty. Oh, my heart goes out to her. 
Oh, I understand. Look, there's a picture of her kitty over there. Oh. Oh, she's so depressed. Not that I'm really one to judge. <laughs> yeah, I've been obsessively freaking out about um about Ella's health. Um so much that I haven't been able to get anything else done for most of the past week. But I'm trying to now that I know that that's the thing I'm doing, I'm trying to not do that. So I wonder whether those pictures in the houses were drawn by Link. That would be really cute. Doesn't Faye from Xenogears do art of his precious little town that does not survive the morning? I never beat Xenogears. I put um, a, a Xenogears cover um, on YouTube and uh, people suggested that I try streaming Xenogears, which I don't know if that would be a good idea, but Weaponized Soul, it wouldn't be nearly as long, but I'm the one playing it. Wow. Hello, funny looking little dude. All right. Froggy climb. Yo. Yes. <laughs> Good line. <laughs> it's so incredibly descriptive of cats. <laughs> I'm sorry. If you ever want like an example of my sense of humor, the phrasing of this sentence is. <laughs> Am I gonna summon a bird? Okay, controlling is hard. <laughs> I'm summoning a bird. Okay, my bandmate Wedge would be able to tell me what kind of bird that was. <gasps> oh, he does! That's why he has that on his wrist. I wondered if he had a birdie. Okay, we're gonna go falcon fishing. I don't know if it's actually a falcon or not. Something about this song makes me think of Suikoden music, which is a good thing. I love Suikoden. Oh, didn't go so well. Why I feel like this is familiar, but that melody is familiar. God, I'm really bad at aiming. Oh, right, I can aim with. Oh, did I hit the wrong button? Oh, I did. Oh, and then I hit the wrong button again. It says something about the music that I just started the game and I can already sing along with it. to go over there okay yeah I was wondering I tried hitting buttons to see if I could make that work Zidar 
Okay. Oh man, I love the Rupee Jingle chime thingy in this game. That's very cute. <laughs> You know, I know that. I recognize that. Maybe it's from having seen part of this game before, but... What button do you use to skip that? See if this is close enough. Yes! Oh man, I like the music. Yay! Cradle get. Yes! I'm gonna make mom so happy. All right, mom. called on my animal friends because I'm a Disney princess. Absolutely. I love how she's she and her child have the same slopey eyes like Oh, she's like so slow because she's so pregnant. She's really cute. All right, mom. She's just she's she's going. She's doing it. She's on her way. On her way. No, but I don't want her to have to speed up, Dismaya. She's so pregnant. I mean, this Link is a Disney princess. He has animal companions. And he's super pretty and plays dress up. Maybe. I don't know. Oh, she's so cute. Oh my gosh, look at how colorful it is. Oh my god, my little foster brother did a good job painting it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Whatever, it's made with heart. <gasps> oh, precious baby child. Now she's gonna just sit here and be like, oof, walking up that hill is hard. Oh. All right, let's go fishing and make a happy cat, shall we? Oh man! Yes! It lets me drag things around on my controller thing. That's the best. Oh my god, this camera angle. So exciting. Oh no, I didn't do it. So you're trying to like attract them with No, I'm not very good at this, guys. Uh... I assume this is what I'm supposed to do. Oh my god, I need a turbo controller! <sighs> oh, 
glue, so it's not mashing it. Don't mash. Okay. Okay. I clearly do not know what I'm doing here. Oh, that was way easier. <laughs> that has to be an intentional translation, small fry. <gasps> Happy cat. What did you think was gonna happen, Link? Oh my god, this camera. Like, the, the like, erratic, crazy camera. Like, switching awfully. Just, like, all over the place. It's kind of amazing. Okay, we did it. I probably can just put that away. <laughs> Maybe. All right, let us go talk to the no longer depressed shopkeeper and see if she will let us have the slingshot so that we can get the bees down for her husband. Da -da, na -na -na -na. <gasps> She's so happy! Wait, did she name her kitty after me? Did she name her kitty after me? Oh, that's so cute why your cats are so good. Yes. Can I get... <laughs> Here's a little bit of an environmental reminder. How many? Oh, I've got 18. I have to go get money. This is very important. Oh my gosh. All right, we're gonna go smash pottery and get money. I'm pretty sure if this rupee respawns. Does this rupee respawn? No, it doesn't. Okay, well that's all right. Yeah, no, I gotta go get some money. Oh, right, pumpkins. I was gonna smash some rocks that nobody owns or will be sad or miss. But I could, I could do that. Or I could destroy someone's livelihood. Oh, but destroying someone's livelihood gives me so much more money. <gasps> Look at that, the little baby pumpkin regrows. I think that that's a baby pumpkin regrowing. I don't know for sure. Oh yeah, they totally are. Okay, good. Okay, well that, I don't even know. He looks like he like dropped it really hard on the ground. Hey. <laughs> oh man, so close. I love that he says, yo. Don't waste food, friends. <laughs> yeah, he just threw it down on the ground again. Okay, well, Dosmea, clearly you are insufficiently destructive. And yes, dear dude, the action that I just took had a really, has a really bad voice. Sorry to any Smashing Pumpkins fans out there. Hi. She's so happy. I'm gonna get this. I'll buy it. <laughs> you naughty thing. It's quote ad, not ad quote. Blake is so excited. Oh my god. Oh, so her husband wants to help her get that stuff to restock in the store. 
You know, the kitty painting, which I'm pretty sure Link made. Which is super cute. Okay, hold on. We're gonna try this. Alright, you ready? Are you ready? You ready? <laughs> They're so mad. I'm so glad that I know what to do. Okay, those are birds, not bees, so we're safe. <laughs> Reversed world? Oh! Is he gonna be right-handed in this game? That's dreadful. Okay, well, he's supposed to be a lefty. He was always a lefty. And since I'm a lefty, for me, that's actually very significant. I was like, oh, Link and I are lefties together. Yeah, I knew that he was right-handed in something because my sister was super bad about it. Uh. All right. Do I want to get rid of my milk and get some honey instead? Is that a thing I want to do? <laughs> or instead, I could just smack myself into that. Oh, I should probably tell this fella that, um, oh, this is probably a good place to jump off with a, with a chicken. Hi. What, you got like a patch on your shoulder. <laughs> oh, I wonder if there's another thing you can do throwing rocks instead of using a slingshot. Because being a lefty is weird and nobody thinks about you. Like, for the longest time when I was a kid, I couldn't even have like regular scissors. Um, they had lefty scissors because regular scissors didn't cut for lefties. They've since improved regular scissors so that they can be used by either hand. But for a while there, it was immensely frustrating. I had, because the lefty scissors, they hurt to use because nobody bothered making them comfortable and they weren't very good at cutting because nobody bothered making them good at cutting because people who are left-handed are just wrong and should switch to being right-handed, right? Right? Oh, could I, Xanilar? Huh. Okay, well, I didn't think of that. Look at this unhappy chicken. Wait, is this one also a rooster? Are they all? No, it's not a rooster. No. Is it? I don't know. Hey, Frieza. It's just like... Oh no, is this the dojo? Oh, that must be my girlfriend. Okay. Let's try again. Yes! I did it! I like how the goat's pride and dignity have been insulted. So it's going to slowly and despondently walk up that hill. <laughs> it's a walk of shame. Yeah, Demi, I know a lot of people of my grandparents' generation especially who like if they were if they were left-handed, they would reach for things with their left hand, like they would get like slapped to force them to use their right hand. It's not as bad with um, like my parents' generation and I haven't ever heard of anyone in my generation having that experience, but yeah. Garnishing the goat from his wages, oh no! But he's such a nice friend! Really, Moth Dude? I mean, I guess if it's like a Japanese definition of manly, where like tenderness and sweetness and softness and skill with animals count as manliness, which I would totally believe because I know that concepts of masculinity are different around the world. Yes, sinister. That's right. I'm sinister. Again, remember, this is mirrored. See, 
so I spelled it as backwards. So I'm left-handed. See, it's on my left. So I'm a sinister person. Oh no, Willow. Yeah, okay, so I guess it did happen, just not with smacks. But it's still happening. That makes me so sad. Like, there's nothing wrong with being a lefty. It doesn't mean anything except that you just happen to, by some fluke, be a lefty. So. Oh. His link here isn't timid. He's just gentle. You know? What a pleasant home! Oh my gosh! I can't turn the camera in here. This is the only place in the game that I can't turn the camera in. This is this is such a pleasant homey spot. Like, oh my god, look! Look! Okay, hold on. No. No! No, no, no! There we go. Look. Look. He has a rocking horse Epina. Isn't that amazing? Amazing? I'm so charmed by that. <laughs> oh my gosh. We're gonna just admire this beautiful little house. Not animal tested. They do have, um, they do have lefty versions of righty desks. They're just less common. All right. Oh, 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 look, see, I'm totally part of the family. There's dad with his sword and mom. And then I guess that's gonna be me and the little boy. Oh my god, that's so cute. So dad is a warrior and apparently has a meat cleaver. Oh my gosh, and so you can tell that that's dad's fishing rod and Colin's fishing rod. What a cute and wholesome family. Why do they all have these giant forks? It's like that's not for cooking. This is where the cooking implements are. Is this like a farming thing? Are giant forks, I guess pitchforks. What do you use a pitchfork for if you're not like having pitchforks and torches to go like kill the beast? What is what is a pitchfork for? What do you do? Okay, this is really precious. Okay. Wait! Oh! Oh! Oh my gosh! Look at that! She's knitting by the fire! With her comfortable cushion to sit on because she's pregnant and everything hurts. Hopefully they won't have to kill the beast. These villagers seem way nicer than the villagers in Beauty and the Beast. I don't think they would kill the beast. Link would make friends with the beast. And fell. Pretty sure. What else was I gonna do? Oh look, laundry! Always, everyone's under things. Where was I gonna go? What was I gonna do? Oh look, there's a ladder. We should climb it. <laughs> and by that apparently mean he doesn't slam his head into the wall though. Oh, he goes up ladders automatically. You don't have to tell him to do that. Oh, you're so smart, Link. Oh, look at this. Look at how big and strong he is. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna climb up this. Whoa, the most monies. Oh, what can I have a birdie do here? <laughs> That's believable, Desmea. Okay, what can I do? that I couldn't do lower on, lower down. Can you bring me a chicken? This chicken has no idea. I think I just won Toilet Princess. Whoo! 
Ooh, I'm gonna give myself a stomachache from laughing if I'm not careful. Hmm. <laughs> All right, where, where should I go? Where can I not easily go otherwise? I guess over there. Is there an easy way onto the, that roof? I don't think there is. Let's see if we can get there. Oh, I don't think we've quite got enough. Need to change the direction of the wind, clearly. <laughs> I got the chicken stuck. Uh, <laughs> thank you, Desmaya. That's a good quote. Oh, no. <laughs> this is an LR. That would be way too dark. Like, Zelda games are dark, don't get me wrong, but they're not that kind of dark. Okay, so... What? Let's take inventory. What else is there to do? Ba -da, ba -da. I'm glad we managed to stop the um, the echo effect because I know that was driving some of you guys crazy. guys I oh my god I mean you, you know what I'm thinking that there should be a convenient bale of hay underneath here oh whoa Link you're so coordinated <laughs> I would fly everywhere if I could. Alright, well, yes, okay. Well, that reminds me that there are children who wanted to see the slingshot, and I think I've solved everyone's problems here, so. Except for that chicken's problems. I think I, I caused more problems for that chicken than I solved. Hello, Gramps. No, Dad. I'm so used hey. to talking to Gramps because of Wind Waker. <laughs> Oh, he's so nice. Okay. So the fact that this is like taking the time to get you acquainted with all of your people, and maybe you would be less acquainted with them if you weren't taking two hours to do it or whatever because I'm me. Colin. I do like it. Yeah, she's like, don't try to ride your horse. Ah. Oh my gosh. Are these children gonna make me hit things with my slingshot? Oh my gosh, of course they are. Okay, Dosmea, for all the good that Link does in this village, they can forgive him a little a little chicken harassment and pumpkin destruction. Yeah, so it's interesting. Um, I play Final Fantasy XIV. It's the only MMO I've ever played. And I'm getting close to Heaven's Word. And prior to that, like, it's all these, like, obnoxious fetch, fetch quests that don't really get you to know things. But there's this, like, whole, like, refugee dilemma. And they've actually done a pretty good job of, like, like making you actually, like, have to go and deliver things to the refugees and talk to a bunch of the refugees, like, in a row. And it, it, it's actually quite effective. Making you interact with NPCs is a pretty good way of making you know those NPCs and care about what's going on with them. I don't recognize this music, but that bulldog child. Preparation is complete. Oh my god. She's so snobby. She's like Angelica from Rugrats. Okay. Oh wow, I just destroyed it. That kid looks so angry. I learned that. That's what I've heard Dosmea, which is I think a really good idea. Um, because 
I, I mean, granted, I only play the game like once or twice a month, so I'm not a tar like the ideal audience for them, but. <laughs> oh my God. The bratty, creepy doll child. <gasps> I just exploded a spider. Link looks so serious. This is good actually. This teaches me how to aim. See? So you want it like there in the V. Okay. This is actually a really good idea. piece of Triforce on my house. Oh look, there's another spider. I'm gonna get you, friend. Yes! and then there's just like my whole head is made of rubber and I don't have any bones. I'm pretty sure that child's an alien. I'm just gonna hit all of you guys with the toy clearly. Okay, hold on. Where are the, where's the remaining target? There it is, oh. There we go. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm a punk just man, okay? <laughs> They're so excited. Look at how cute they are. I mean, they're also kind of horrifying, but also they're kind of cute, you know? Like real children. <laughs> man <laughs> see this child is not human first of all they act like no human child of this age and also they have no skeleton and are made of rubber <laughs> and it's clearly intentional All right, you little bratty brats. <laughs> Colin is like, no, you still may not. Still may not take your horse out on her day off. Oh, I don't know why I'm yawning, oh, but I am. Oh, the animation is really nice on him coming in. <gasps> he make a treasure chest oh my god Colin's dad is unnecessarily dramatic and I love it like he holds this up he holds this up the stairs up the ladder just like climbed the ladder one armed holding this under his other arm maybe he's dropped it to his back or use a system of pulleys and levers or he could just like put a sword. It's a wooden sword. You could just like put that on his back and carry it up here, no big deal. But instead, also I like how I can go uninvited into their houses, but they can also go uninvited into my house. It's a, uh, what's the word? 
telescoping sword? Okay, I would believe that. The Triforce makes you see chests that aren't even there. I'm gonna whack things with my sword. Yes, oh my god. That's dangerous. That is, in fact, an Ella crashed out right there. Such a cutie cat. Yeah, Link's earrings. Link is especially cute in this game. Oh, he's so good at that. No. No. <laughs> oh my god, this child. This possessed demon child. All right. Sure. That kid was so excited. Apparently thou must. Oh my god. This child, is, the baby is unimpressed. Oh my god. <laughs> this is way too many moves. There's no way that I'm gonna be able to keep track of any of this. Oh man, look, baby child. I'm gonna hit everyone and everything with that if you're not careful. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, is totally the sound he makes. Everyone was impressed by that. It was revealed that the scarecrow was a pumpkin all along. That monkey has a lollipop over their ear. Oh no, Link. So this is the darkest haired Link we've seen, isn't it? Did the monkey go this way? Did I go the wrong way? Am I doing this right? I don't know. We'll find out. I don't know if I would say the baby is the ringleader, but the baby is definitely the leader in some capacity. Oh no, they ran that way! But your legs are like three times as long as theirs. Then again, you are a 100% human child. Baby? That was not ominous. The rest is up to you. All right, clearly this is happening to get me to this special secret space. Can I just like, um, I, What happens? What happens if I do that? I want to know. <laughs> like, is it going to load my save? Is it going to start me off at the beginning of the bridge? Okay, so I'm on my second heart and there's wind involved, apparently, because there's winds around the hearts in the corner. I had to check, okay? Oh, look, I've got a mini map. Oh, I forgot about that. 
I, it looks like I've got an umbrella. You know who else who fights with an umbrella? Cecil from Final Fantasy IV after he becomes a paladin. I like that apparently this wooden sword is sharp enough to mow lawns. These are the important things to do in life. Also, I need a heart because I jumped off cliff. <laughs> By cliff, I mean. Oh! Oh, the penguin does fight with an umbrella. Hi, Epona. Oh, really, Xanalar? Oh, I guess I do need Epona. Yeah! Wait, is this a different space than I've been? I want to go explore that, but I'm probably supposed to go this way. Hmm. This looks like an important place that I should be. Oh, shoot. Is there a bad guy here? Did bad guy happen? Oh! I love that little chi charm. Oh no! That's not good. Okay, Epona. We're gonna go to the other place we're supposed to go. Get on the horse! I just wanted to see what happened. Like, I, I read the sign though. away dismount buttons I can buttons okay what's up here hmm hmm you have weird hair you have a bird's nest on top of your head Pay you. <laughs> How do I turn that off? <laughs> How do I put the lantern away? How do I turn the lantern off? He told me. Okay, I put it away. Oh good, I can just kind of waltz into this person's house. Uh, this place looks like it has been wrecked set it on fire, but I won't. <laughs> That's a dangerous power to have. Yeah, I saw the, um... Oh, Ella is having chomp chomp chomps time. So you probably won't be able to hear Ella meowing now that I've turned down the gain on my microphone. Oh good, we rolled. Epona says no to enemies. Okay. Yay, I got a 
heart. This music sounds a lot like the music that plays. Oh, I guess I should probably light this. It sounds like the music that plays um, in those weird Mukau places. You know, in Ocarina of Time, the weird alien Mukau places. It's not actually pitch dark here. I was expecting it to be scarier. Oh, I'm going to set that on fire. I'm not sure what that did, but um, I tried it. I guess I could probably hit those with this. Yeah, monies. I mean, it's also possible that my television is turned up pretty bright, but I don't know how it looks to you guys. you bad guys. <laughs> Alright. I love how he kicks the little ones open. grass regrow here? Is that a thing that happens? <laughs> I don't even need that heart. Oh yeah, I made it through! Alright. Where is the bad guy? There's a bad guy. Looks like this was a bridge and then the bridge got smashed. And I don't have a hook shot of any sort. Hey! There's goblins in this game. Why is there a goblin here? This isn't where goblins are supposed to be in my idyllic little land. Also, what are you eating? Gross. Hmm. Aha. Moblins. I know I'm never gonna get the name right. Although I guess it's kind of, it kind of makes sense. Because, like, isn't a mom an enemy and... What is making such creepy, evil, bad music? There it is! Hello, friend. Goodbye, friend. It was nice knowing you. It wasn't really, but unfortunately it was pretty short-lived. Darn it! Fortunately, moblins are pretty, uh, pretty, uh, weak? Is that the word I'm looking for? Oh, I wanted to jump attack you, but I don't know how to do that. Shh, blue glass, we can totally retro. Oh, there's no, 
There's a word for it when you retro do something like that. When you retroactively determine what, what the etymology of a word is. I cannot remember what it's called. But there is a term for that. I see I'm just poking things with my sword. Stabbing. Retronym, that might be it. All right, we gotta find a key. Where are we gonna find a key? On a bad guy? Maybe I can set that door on fire. Where am I? Okay. No, hold on. This is where I came from. I'm looking at my mini map like a person who's played a video game before. If I had a chicken, I would jump off right here. Walk, walk, walk. But I don't have a chicken. Oh, so if I roll aggressively at them with my sword, that's a jump attack. Good to know. I'm so glad that Zelda games have relatively simple combat. I don't even need anything. Why am I mowing this lawn? Look at that, like, s I stabbed the lawn. I stabbed those bl blades of grass off. Hello, enemies. Oh, good. Yes, yeah, some of the puzzle moments I was very proud of myself for solving. Bad guy, I hear you. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Um. There were puzzles that I was proud of myself for solving during Wind Waker, and then there were puzzles that I was just like, please tell me what to do. Oh, I should have, I should have jump attacked it, or slashed it, or something. What do you say? I want a key. Do I have enough oil or do I want to go refill? Do you guys have any guidance on that? Where do I find a key? Oh my gosh. Ha! Huh. Just slam your face into walls. I'm pretty sure that's the best possible puzzle tactic. So I figured I've been really conservative in my use of it. Look at how wonderful it is that the grass grows back so I can have like so much lawn mowing. Wag your sword randomly at the bat and eventually it'll run right into your sword. It's great. I don't know what to do here. Let's actually try to take inventory and solve this problem instead of randomly squawking and running around in circles. Have I been up this way before? I don't think I have. I don't think I have. What does being up here allow me to do? Ah, no. That looks like what I'm supposed to do. Well, because he's hitting with a wooden stick, it's kind of like he's batting the bats with his bat. Okay. That didn't work. Hmm. That looks awfully precise. Do I have to do this? Like this jump? Oh, hey, hello, friend. How do I get to you? How do I get to you? Hmm. If I had a bird, maybe it could get me that treasure chest. Oh, did I run out of power? I think I did. Zafric, thank you for, uh, Thank you for the, uh, oh, I'm supposed to thank. There, I hit thank. I don't know what that just did, but okay. 
Okay, so apparently... Eh? No! Okay, so apparently my... I just didn't notice my battery power was running out. That's no good. Wait, did the stream die? Okay, good. Yeah, no, it was just that the, uh, I did not notice if there was, like, a little battery thing blinking in the corner. I need to do better about charging my Wii. This is where I came from. Yes, yes, this is where I came from. Not going back. I'm trying to consult my mini-map. I'm trying to both consult my mini-map and use problem solving. Okay, so this way goes here and I need a key. Yes, yes, I can hear there's a bad guy. Can't climb any of this stuff. My Wii U Wii mote. What? It's not a Wii mote. What's it called? What's this thing called? Also, look at the textures on that. That's very nice. Can I climb up you? No, I can't climb up you. Your Wii U gamepad, right? It's a gamepad. Oh, how I haven't been this way, have I? This isn't where I came from, or there wouldn't be bats here. Okay, we figured it out. Oh, yes. There's totally a spoilers channel on our Discord specifically. And just ask the mods to let you go there. And it's for, it's the, specifically the stream spoilers channel so that you can't spoil um, the, the things that I'm playing. So if you're like going out of your mind because I didn't see something or I don't know what I'm doing or I've like said the wrong. <laughs> Kick. I got the small key. How do I get up there? Can I just, oh, I can just help. Yes, I'm tall instead of small as I was in Wind Waker. Ooh, the piece of heart looks so cool here. Cool. Oh, I should probably save my game, shouldn't I? Save game. Bing, bing, bing. Bidding, bidding, bidding. <laughs> All right. Oh no, the bad guys respawn. Whatever will I do? Swing my sword at them and make them toast. Obviously, no, we want the mini map, not the items. Okay, I'm consulting my mini-map on where to go instead of running around like I don't know how to play the game. Oh my gosh! No, it's not that they're eating something, it's that they have poison breath. Gross! They're like drooling acid or something. Yuck. Hang on, I gotta kill this guy. The guess goes against my usual pacifistic approach to video games. Why do the bats have, like, I guess they have blades in their tails? I feel like I've gotten better at Zelda games. Alright, buddy, are you ready? I feel kind of bad. Oh, that heart got stuck on the wall. Oh my god. Link. So much destruction. So much stuff. Oh. 
Tyler. It's a moblin party. What the heck? Why does the parrot have a fro? I don't understand. Okay. Be wee. Buy something, will ya? Oh my gosh, there's a thing to put the money in. Oh, it's potions. Nah. Trill is his name. Cause that's not oil. Oh, it is oil! Oh, I guess I could do that. This is a health potion. <laughs> yeah, no, that would make sense, Willis, since they and this one he's sitting by a lantern too. I got to admit, for someone with a fire phobia, I sure am tempted to set literally everything on fire. The grass could be on fire. The ivy could be on fire. Fam flammable cloths around the shop could be on fire. So do I want to refill my fire right now? They've got the grass here in case you need it to get some monies. Yeah, okay, I'll ask straight up. Is your advice? I've got a, I've got a little over half. Like, is it better for me to refill my oil right now? Am I going to regret it if I go in without? Okay. Let's go fight some bad guys. Oh, look! There's a little treasure chest! Hello, treasure chest. What have you got for me? Kick it open? It's a monies! Oh, this is cool! I'm going into a Deku tree. Oh my god! They put the, both the monkey and the child in a cage. This is totally the pathway for a little boulder rolling ball thing to come clattering down and destroy everything. Hey, buddies. Guess who's gonna get hit by a sword? Oh, it's you! And also you! Okay. Yay! Now the monkey's obligated to be my friend. Oh my god, the monkey sounds like a spring, a squeaky spring. All right. Link is like, what have you learned, child? Oh. Oh, child. He doesn't even doesn't even give me a chance. Hi, Dad. I mean, there's goblins. That's not usually normal or good. I'm sure he's got a reason. I'm sure that I have like a prophecy destiny and that's why he's like, oh, you need to go to Hyrule. This this particular time, it has to be you. French horn. Oh, Link. You're gonna be leaving home for the first time. Are you having feelings? Oh, look, it's my super buff big nose buddy. Okay. <laughs> it's not just a triangle, he has the whole Triforce. Okay. Hi, Apana. 
Does the word pony have any etymological basis in Epona? I find this link's um, expressions are better than a cardboard cutout. Um, yeah, no, but I'm wondering because Epona was a, was a horse deity or a horse figure. Is the, 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 the word pony etymologically descended from that deity? Um, but yeah, I feel like this, this um, link has a personality, just a smaller one. And Link from Wind Waker had so much personality. He just... That Link had a... Oh my god. Oh no! No, there's a time limit. That's the worst. There's no way we're gonna get this, guys. Oh my god, I ran him down. Yes! I'm doing all right. I'm keeping them in, in chunks. Go on. Get your sheepy butts over that way. Go on. Okay, this one guy is going to be a butt. Go on. Ah. Uh, in. In. Okay, then there's just this one last butt. Where are you, butt? Yeah, I'm coming for you. Blue glass. <laughs> I think I did okay. But I'm very proud of myself. Oh my god, this guy's adorable. Yeah! Jump that fence! Hey, canned laughter! She's really excited. Oh, she's only got the little, like, loopy on one side. Wait, is Mr. Tusks her dad? I think he is. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So even though we're not seeing their conversation, we're seeing that the two of them are having a conversation. Establishing that they have a relationship. Oh, see, like, it shows him talking. I do a bad job. Oh, he looks like he's in trouble. Oh my gosh. The Link's face. He's like, oh no, I'm in trouble. Oh my god, this is really cute. Oh. Everyone is yelled at by the mayor's daughter. <laughs> okay, that's really cute. The two of them giving each other a look. This is cute. I don't think Hyrule's gonna annex this town. I mean, it's not that I'm not gonna have Epona, she just has to go take a bath. You can take a bath and then still have time. Oh no! 
I did bad. I did bad. I thought I was supposed to go in there and get the gift, but I guess I wasn't. Hi, Mom. Oh, she's such a mom. He's like, please let me teach you to be the best swordsman in the land. <laughs> no gift for horse injuries, yes. Oh my god, this place is still so cute. Okay, if anything happens to this family, I'm gonna go murder everyone. And by that I mean the bad guys. Just like... I mean... Are you still hanging out here, buddy? Must be nice going on errands, he says. She just, like her like just like staring lovingly at her cat is a mood that I know very well. Her face, the faces are all really expressive. Like, they do a lot with the eyebrows. Like, this is, like, by far the most, like, detailed faces in any Zelda game. And it's great. They've all got character. Okay, who do I have to go meet slash yell at? Oh, the children! I have to go get them in trouble. Is this their house? Whose house is this? I'm slow at playing video games, guys. Here's the children's house. <gasps> puppy! I'm just gonna pick up the puppy and go talk to mom. <laughs> oh, she's like, she looks like grumpy and then she sees that it's Link and she smiles. Everyone gossips in this small town. That's very accurate from my understanding of small towns. <laughs> oh my God. Lady, your your youngest. I, I hate to break it to you, but I'm pretty sure that child isn't human. Everybody likes Link, because he's a good dude who just sometimes smashes pumpkins. What a cute puppy! Oh my God, the puppy's little legs! Look at those little leggies. Oh, the little wagging tail. That's just like, oh my God! Look at this puppy! Look at this puppy! Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my god, guys. Okay. This looks like the puppy holding a sword. And the puppy is slicing a pumpkin. I don't know if that's the pumpkin. Or the puppy. Alright, that was cute. <laughs> I think this is way funnier than I probably think it should think it is. Alright, puppy, fine, you win. It is like a real dog. Alright. Working in the fields for pumpkins. I don't know. Okay, puppy, I'm gonna let you go. I know it's the worst. I'm leaving. Oh my god. How could I? Nox used to be like that. And so if I'd leave and then I'd come home, like if I like forgot something right after I left, she'd be like right there staring at the door waiting for me to come home. Basically the best animal ever. Um, I'm glad I can't hurt that puppy. That puppy is a good puppy. All right. I bet the children are gonna be hanging out by my place because they're my stalkers. Oh, you can't hurl them? Yeah, no, you absolutely can't. That would be mean. This Link would never throw a puppy across the room. Those guys? Who are those guys? Is it you two? Are you being brats? Do I have to like, 
yell at you. Oh my god, look at that baby's dance. Oh my god. That's creepy. I like dolls, but that baby is not human. Oh my god. Uh huh. Nope. Hello, slightly less immature baby child. Uh, child. Child. Okay, fine. I guess I am the cool uncle. This kid is going to get hurt. <sighs> oh, okay, that's acceptable. Oh. No, you don't have to be. Yeah. Be the animal loving side of Link, not the sword swinging side of Link. Man, even the little chipmunk squirrel has frozen staring at me on the tiptoes. Does Link seem like the sort of guy who would push past children? Not, does Link, controlled by Lauren, seem like the sort of guy who would push past children? But does Link himself seem like he would push children? There's going to be bad guys and I'm going to have to sneak in through that sneaky sneak that I found. Did they close the door again? They did. Oh no! Huh? Okay. I'm definitely going to have to come back here when some horrible crisis is happening, though, and use that to get through there. Pretty sure of it. Oh, I don't have my sword. So, oh, look, they put a rupee in here, so I'm actually supposed to go this way. I'm supposed to last time, when I wasn't. Colin is a sweet, precious cinnamon roll of a child. And it's nice that the children are all different personalities. I mean, they're all kind of like archetypal personalities but like you know there's like the spunky spunky slightly bratty girl the super bratty troublemaking little boy the you know alien baby <laughs> and then the sweet sensitive kid right here she's not very practical about this like the horse is going to get injured sometimes Yeah, you can't make my horse like you better by going swimming all the time. This isn't like Harvest Moon, where you like can do the same thing over and over again and develop a friendship. They keep saying this. You're just a lowly village boy. Don't go trying to save the world or anything like that. Oh shoot! Oh no! <gasps> no! Hold on! That's a goblin on a boar and it just shot my girlfriend. Uh, to be fair, even with my sword, I couldn't have stopped this. So this is a significant 
and powerful place. Why are they not grabbing Link and taking him prisoner? What the heck? Like how Link doesn't even stop to look around. He doesn't notice the weird, creepy thing in the sky. Because he's going to get his girlfriend. Wow, there's some weird light bloom happening here. Oh. Um... Guess we're not gonna go to Hyrule Castle today. Holy crap! It's like Majora. Oh, yes, my Triforce will blind you. Go away, bad guy. Is this like world coming apart and bits of it are flying up? Is this the dark world? Oh my god, it's totally the dark world, but instead of turning into a bunny, for some reason I turned into a woofy. Now I'm the puppy. Oh my god, now they're dragging my poor puppy self away. That's Midna. She's a good guy. She's going to be my sidekick. And I remember thinking that I, uh, yes. Oh, oh, this is good. This is a good reminder. Do you want to save? Yes. So. Oh, we're a chained puppy. Oh, we've still got our little earrings, though. He's actually really expressive as a puppy, too. Like, like, that was a good... Okay. Okay, so I've got dig, dash, and attack. Do I have a bark button? I want a bark button. That counts. <gasps> oh, he's trying so hard. She's such a creepy looking little imp. And dark and light is definitely a thing that's going on here. My friend, um, Kristen, who plays English Horn, um, and she puts YouTube covers up as Field of Reeds. I think she loves this game because she loves wolves so much. So she did a cover of Midna's theme. She's, oh, look at his little angry nose sniffs. The camera framing next to her butt kind of makes me uncomfortable. Because I already know how the internet feels about her. But uh she's she is adorable, just also. I am the woof woof. Yes, Jando Mass Effect does that too. Very much so. It's very frustrating and one of the things that I like least about Mass Effect. Yeah, no, Willow, I, I think that's fair. And the internet went nuts over that. I'm glad that you guys are also thinking of Miranda. We can also talk about Star Ocean 4 and how angry I got about the way it treated Raimi doing the same kind of camera angle. Um, 
Yeah, Midna's is a little sass pants. The fact that she's got a belly button does kind of make it a bit more uncomfortable. Yay! Am I going to have this chain on for the rest of forever? Is this going to be like the third Sands of Time game? Where you like have your chain and that's a thing you use? Doing the floaty things are going off into what the heck? Oh my god! She just like broke down into. Yeah, I really, I really don't like the fact that like little bits of the ground. Okay, so I can dig. I mean, I would be able to dig if there's any digging to be done over here. Okay, well. It's nice to know that I can- Oh, good! I can totally dig here. It's nice to know that I can also headbutt my way into things. I can roll headbutt into walls as a puppy, too. I remember that I liked her eventually, and I liked Tetra eventually, so I'm gonna go with this and try not to dislike her for being a bratty princess type. I don't like bratty princess types. I was so disappointed by Kumatora and Mother 3 because everyone loves Kumatora, and then I really didn't. But it's an archetype I didn't like, so I know that I wound up liking her the first time around. I don't remember how or why, but I'm gonna trust that memory. You use her hair to do stuff, right? This doesn't... Okay, so like... Those little, like, floaty bits make me think of, like, Transistor and, um... She's, so she'll look at the thing to do, okay. Oh, and also, um, some of the other games. Oh my god, okay. We did that. Hold on, wait, can I go through here? No, I can't. Did I skip something? Did I accidentally go the way I'm supposed to go? Unthinkable. That's true, they don't usually have... Okay. Oh my god, so instead of... I have a new way of being destructive. The thing is people sometimes actually want you to mow their lawn. I'm pretty sure no one ever wants you to just dig up their yard. Okay. I see a blue light. Green light. She sounds like a creature, a person from a Team Ico game. Oh my god. Oh, it's a dude! It's... It's like a... This kind of makes me think of, um, Soul Blazer. Here, careful, Stanilar, until I get the game telling me what this thing is, or what this sort of thing is. 
Oh, shoot. I just jumped into the water. I didn't want to because there's... Do you see that? That. Okay, so there are two overlapping worlds. Light world and dark world. Wow, the animation is really good. Do you see that little thing? Oh, it wants to come up and kill me so badly. What if I don't want it to kill me, huh? What's that? Just a regular skull? <laughs> I am very curious about her mask. I'm going to just straight up guess that her mask is. I don't, please don't tell me. Um. did it wrong. I'm going to guess that her mask thing is like cursing her or something like that, but I don't know. I do not remember. No, I want to... How do I... Uh... Uh... Okay, how did I do this last time? Hooked onto it and then bit... Oh! Oh, okay. What did that do? Okay, so there's nothing here. Okay, that's bad. I bet I want to go where those spikes are. Oh, uh... timed is there another one over here ah okay yes ah the water level's gonna go up Yeah, the animations are really, uh, I'm swimming over those spikes. I guess that's one way of getting away from spikes, huh? Those guys really want to kill me, huh? Okay, apparently I can't kill them when I'm in water. Sorry, folks, I'm low on health. Hello, friend. I need some more HPs. What are you doing, Midna? Midna! Midna, I'm like out of HPs, okay? I want to get up there and do that, but I guess I don't get to. I could really use HPs. I could use a heart. 
but maybe. Yay! I got a heart. Okay, so no attacking in water. Got it. Can I get that? No, I can't. I just knocked myself off the ledge. Um, uh, well. Don't know what to do. Oh, have I been through there? Is that where I came from right over here? Are those where the spikies go? No. There's gonna be some bad guys in there. Get out of the water. Okay, I did it. You should start. Are there any more bad guys here? So it looks like, looks like the real world is having some problems. I don't know, I mean, I guess we're in, I guess maybe we're in Hyrule now? Hopefully I don't regret having done that. Uh, okay, Midna. Oh, I see. Ah, it's claustrophobic. Those things are kind of scary. Oh, I can dig here. I want to listen to this guy. He's just going to be sad. I want to, buddy. Believe me, I do. What am I digging up? Monies? Okay. Well, this is good to know. Hearts. All right, mid 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 knee. <sighs> I am trying. We're probably in Hyrule Castle. But like Dark World. Hy Hyrule Castle. Uh oh. This looks like there might be a mini boss. The music here makes me think of something from one of the other Zeldas and I don't know what. Camera, you can get me killed, camera. Oh goodness, that didn't work. Midna, look, if you want it done differently, then you gotta help me, friend. Okay. some platforming but with okay well that died Do I have to walk across this? I bet I do. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. 
Unfortunately, Link is better at following a straight path than I am. Okay. This looks like an important place that we're in right now. And there's bats in the belfry. I like that the only way to fight things as a dog is to throw yourself bodily at them. You know? Like, you can't, like, swing a weapon and not slam your entire body into it. Hmm. Oh. What did she say? Okay. face into a wall is how I know I'm playing a Zelda game. Look, it's the Hyrule Crest, and we're in Hyrule Castle, and it's probably going to play some version of Hyrule Castle's theme. But we can't hear it under all of the, uh, rain and evil shadow thing. Shadow contamination. Conchamin- shadow nation- I don't know. He's never been here, Midmuck. Cut him some slack. Oops. Oh no, this feels like Dark Souls, and I'm expecting a dragon to come crashing out of the sky at any minute. Zero. We're just out of the intro section, sort of. Birds. Oh, good. Oh, where could we be? Where could we be? It's Hyrule Castle. Okay, well, we'll try to get to the tower if we can. And then we will, um... Probably have to stop then. Hello, bad guy. Goodbye, bad guy. Oh wait, you're not dead yet? You want ba you want more? Well Bye. Bye, bad guy. Okay, that's not a way to go. We're not gonna go that way. Haha! <laughs> yes, they can be like Android plummeting off the parapets. They've kind of got, like, monkey faces. Oh my god, there's, like, screaming horns. It's amazing. Yes, Midna, we know you're incredibly unimpressed with everything. Or at least you're putting on a big show about being unimpressed about everything. I'm sorry, that's... I couldn't help myself.
This has the same sort of, um, the notes are being played backwards thing that, um, happened, uh, in a Wind Waker when you got to the castle. Oops. Darn it. Okay, there we go. I don't even need the heart. Oh, the nice thing about hitting the attack button is that he growls first. Who could that mysterious cloaked figure with Triforce, like, Hyrule crests around here possibly be? Gosh, it's a mystery. There are only two people who could look ominously out a window wearing a cape. One is evil and one is not, and this one is not nearly huge enough to be Ganondorf. She doesn't have a voice. The uh, voice movement, or the voice and the mouth movement don't exactly line up. Well, I guess I do still have that thing on my, on my ankle. It's not so good. I guess it's my wrist, technically. <laughs> They stole my girlfriend. Yeah, somebody should probably tell Link what's up. Maybe. Oh, she's the Twilight Princess. That's the name of the game, guys. Whoa! Sorry, I'm joking around, but, um... Yes, you can see her, uh... Her headpiece there. Mm. The king that rules the twilight. Who could that be? That's a mystery. Hmm. Okay. I want beautiful music as you tell me this, this legend. That'll do. Oh, it's the three goddesses. Bunch of guards. This music gets me every time. Doesn't matter what version it is. This looks like Dark Souls, doesn't it? Oh, jeez, there's a lot of them. Yeah, the bad guys don't even, like, stop to think about them. There's some. Okay. Okay, so I will say we've already done masks, but it looks like we're doing masks again, so I assume that, boy, do these guys look kind of like Shadow of the Colossus slash Ico creatures. That does not look like Ganon. That is nowhere near as gigantic as Ganon. Also, like, like it's, there's a basilisk face happening there, you know? Those look like giant eyes that would turn you to stone. Then a tongue that might turn you to stone, too. Did you notice that the guy with the mask behind him, the mask has, like, the single horn thingy, like the goats? What are you gonna do, Zelda? I do like that she has a sword. That's cool. The goddesses. No, she wants to save her people because she is a good princess. Oh, jeez. Okay, so everyone in Hyrule does have pointy ears. That one looked like a Lollafell. Huh. So 
so it took the light away. That does seem to be true of what I've seen so far. So she saved them from dying with the hopes that she will be able to save them in the long run. She looks so done with this. The piss, yeah. <laughs> so it's <all> okay. <laughs> She's got a mask though, that's significant. These two are definitely peers on some level for all that Midna is being goofy. They already got me with, with Tetra. They're not gonna get me with Midna. I know, I know. She's just putting up this tough girl act, but actually she's probably really serious on some level. Why are they looking for you? God, Zelda looks so tired and stressed. Which is, I mean, reasonable. Can we just fight the guard instead? Is that a viable option? Is that allowed? Can I dig in here? Oh, wow, I can totally set myself on fire. Well, that's good to know. I had to do it twice to be sure. Oh no guard is coming. It's Ganon. It's not the guard. It's it's Ganon. Hold on. I bet. I bet it's Ganon. Come to gloat. Although we haven't... That, that dude, I swear, a cockatrice mask guy, basilisk mask, I guess basilisk mask, did not look nearly big enough to be Ganon. And Ganon is always big. He's always got shoulders, at least. Look, canned laughter. You never know. Yeah, Xanalar. I guess that's true. Doesn't Dorf mean village in German? Oh my god. Such a brat. Oh my god, Midna. Ugh. <sighs> it's just kind of funny when that sort of thing happens in a character's name. Not that it's significant, it's just a funny observation. Because there's Ganon the monster and then Town Ganon, the human form. <laughs> it's, his, it's, it's, his, it's his form for going about the town. It's City Ganon versus like Demon Land Ganon, you know? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Town. <laughs> Can somebody write a song called Ganon Town? Is there some song we can alter the lyrics of that's something town, but we can make it Ganon Town? Because I would be all about that. Oh, Link is Link does not approve of any of this. He's like, you little brat. She's doing this for a reason, though. She, okay, yeah, we could do Funky Town, but it could be Ganon Town. Ganon Town. Oh my God. Hades Town, my roommate likes that musical. She's told me good things about it, but I have not watched or listened to it yet. Oh no, he's village! He's little bitty village cannon! Oh. 
<laughs> oh, he's been walking around in circles. I'm a puppy. <laughs> So we should shut down here. What? Oh my god. They just dog proofed this place. Can you believe the audacity? Oh, she's my shadow. We are going to save the game because it is 1040 and I have work to do still. So I'm going to be up late tonight. <sighs> so thank you guys for joining me on my first stream of Twilight Princess. Despite our um, delay in getting started. Um... There's a lot happening here. There's characters I got to know. And I am oh, anonymous cheer. Thank you. We will be streaming this again next Tuesday and we will continue streaming it every Tuesday until we beat the game with the exception of a couple of times that I'll be out of town. Um, but yeah. Uh, tune in Thursday for the remnants of or the remainder of Frog Fractions. And then after that, we'll be doing Return of the Obra Din on Thursdays. Thank you for following Tizzle, Tizzle, Tizzle. Um, and for the other new followers, thank you for joining. I'm a little slow at playing my way through games, but as long as you don't mind, that we will pick up every dog. Except when I guess when we are the dog, then Midna will pick up every dog. Um, we will see you folks later. Thanks, Willow. <laughs> you know what you're getting into here. Man, I thought I just dawdled a lot. <laughs> How slow did you guys think I was going to be? <laughs> All right, good night, everybody. I will see you lovely folks later. <laughs>